A great feature in Axle is the ability to change the logo seen at the login and for each user to personalise the user experience. Logos are managed in the Appearance tab in the admin pages. All the logos available are shown here. There are two sets of logos. One set for use with the light theme, another set for use with the dark theme. There are some rules around the logo in terms of pixel size and file size. The login logo file size is not too critical as it only loads at the login page. The logo pixel size should be 500 by 200 pixels or less if possible. Files that are larger than 500 by 200 may cause the login area to move on the screen. In this example, we can see the default logo supplied with the system. Everything is central on the login page. If I switch to a logo that is too large for the page, in this case, the logo is 1070 by 530 pixels. I will set this as the login logo on the Appearance Admin page. Then in the User tab, I'll simply refresh the browser to see the new logo. Notice how the logo is off-center and the login lines are lower in the frame. I'll now switch back to the other logo in the Admin tab. After a refresh, the logo that's within the size limits looks much better. The user logo is the logo that appears at the top left of the display. Ideally, this logo should be kept to around 150 pixels by 25 pixels and under 20 kilobytes in size. The file size is important as the logo will be loaded every time the page changes. The easiest way to add a new logo is to upload the required logo using the interface's upload button. This will place the logo file in the correct folder for Axel. It will be then made available for the users. In addition to adding logos, admins can also remove unwanted logos from the Axel system. Clicking Delete will remove the unwanted logos altogether. Once the required logos are uploaded, the admin can move to the User tab and select the users they want to update. Firstly select a user, then at the bottom of the interface, the current logo can be seen. Clicking on Select from Existing will show the logos available in the system. Select the required logo and click Save. The user must log out and back into Axel to see the new logo. By selecting the other users in the Admin tab, they can all have different logos. Here the Axel user has this logo, and the user Neil has a different logo.